Hi, I'm Marty Nemco. In uh, keeping with the upcoming Halloween and uh, perhaps truncated by COVID, I thought I'd read you a, uh, a short, short story, probably uh, more appropriate for adults than kids. Pretty scary. It's called Guardians by Dark Alligator. That's the author. His pen name, obviously. It's Guardians is the title, and Dark Alligator is the author. He awoke to the huge, insect-like creatures looming over his bed, and he screamed his lungs out. The creatures hastily left the room, and he stayed up all night, shaking and wondering if it had been a dream. The next morning, there was a tap on the door. Gathering his courage, he opened it to see one of the creatures gently place a plate filled with fried breakfast on the floor then retreat to a safe distance. Bewildered, he accepted the gift. The creatures chittered excitedly. This happened every day for weeks. At first, he was worried they were fattening him up, but after a particularly greasy breakfast left him clutching his chest from heartburn, those fattening breakfasts were replaced with fresh fruit. As well as cooking, they poured hot, steamy baths for him and even tucked him in when he went to bed. It was bizarre. One night, he awoke to gunshots and screaming. He raced downstairs to find a decapitated burglar being devoured by the insects. He was sickened, but disposed of the remains as best as he could. He knew that the creatures had been protecting him. One morning, the creatures wouldn't let him leave his room. He lay down, confused, but trusting as they ushered him back into bed. Whatever their motives, they weren't going to hurt him. Hours later... A burning pain spread through his body. It felt like his stomach was filled with razor wire. The insects chittered as he spasmed and moaned. It was only when he felt a terrible squirming feeling beneath his skin that he realized the insects hadn't been protecting him. They had been protecting their young. In any event, I do thank you for watching. I'm Marty Nemco. I welcome your thumbs up and accept your thumbs down. I always look forward to your comments and especially like it if you hit the share button below. Share on your social media so that my efforts can have broader impact. And I am flattered if you choose to subscribe to my channel, which usually is my self-help advice around career, relationships, money, the meaning of life. But occasionally I intersperse my piano playing and reading others' work as I did here today. In any event, I do thank you for watching. I'm Marty Nemco.